Hello viewers, welcome to the section Automation using ServiceNow Orchestration. In this section we will learn about activating the plugin from a developer instance, active directory orchestration and creating a service catalogue using orchestration workflow. Now we move on to the video activating the plugin from a developer instance. In this video we will find a list of plugins to activate. Before we activate the plugin from a developer instance we will first know what is orchestration. ServiceNow orchestration helps to facilitate and bridge the gap by helping to align all pieces involved to automate the required piece of process activity or function. These are achieved through the workflows in the ServiceNow world. When a process or function or an activity involves an external activity to be automated outside ServiceNow, orchestration helps to facilitate the automation. ServiceNow orchestration can be leveraged to perform simple to complex automation tasks that are not limited. Some tasks which we will see now. Password reset process, cloud provisioning, server reboot, and software asset management. Orchestration is initiated through the orchestration workflow. The orchestration workflow launches a probe and puts the workflows in a pause state. The mid server executes the probe against the target infrastructure device. Once the probe results are retrieved, the workflow is resumed. Now we will activate the plugin from a developer instance. Log on to your instance management. Click on the Action drop down menu and then select Activate Plugin. Now you will find a list of plugins that you can activate. You will need to activate the Orchestration plugin and also the Orchestration Active Directory plugin. Click on Activate next to the Orchestration plugin. You will see a series of prompts before the plugin gets installed. Once the plugin installs, you will either receive an email if the installation is taking a long time or you will receive confirmation on the screen. In our case, we will receive an email. In this video, we have activated the plugin from a developer instance. 